uh, here we go, folks. Um, top five Corlysis half up. Shack a lot. Corliss has a runner on. Ran right into the tag. Out number one. Drops in a curveball. Woo! Two away. Three up, three down. We're midway through the inning. Cyclones coming to bat. Nine two ball game. <laughs> First pitch gets by. In there for a strike. Low. Safe first. New pitcher on the bump for the uh, Trojans. After the installation of another pitcher, play resumes. Runner on first. Yeah, everybody's looking around. Yeah, and uh, he does what I do too. There goes the runner. No throw on the play. Players want to talk. 
My wife is 51, so she, uh, like I said, 30, 30 years of marriage, man. And, and I love, I do it. I love it. Second time. Second time. Second time. Second time. Woo, the first one was scary. <laughs> Oh, you, you come get a better view? That was a balk, and that will send the uh, base runner to third base. Be ready to catch the ball if it comes over this way. Actually, don't catch it. Just <laughs> Don't worry about the girl what the girl say. Get, the, get out of the way. Have they ever hit your camera? I've had cameras hit, tripods hit, bent legs. I've been hit three times. One time, off the bat of my son's back. The ball was curving. I'm moving back and this curve didn't hit me. <laughs> Another time, I was catching the ball, but I had a camera in one hand. I misjudged it and it glanced me on the temple. But, um, but like I said, I do all sports. So I've been run over by football players. <laughs> yeah, I've been hit by tennis balls. Oh <laughs> Uh, yeah, like I say, I, 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 I do as many sports as I can get in, man. And like I said, night, if you Google me, look at, like the numbers don't good, but uh, if you Google me, cameraman John, that's all you need. And, and I'll pop the ball over. And uh, there's a bunt. Foul ball. And a lot of close-ups because when you make it a highlight tape, the coach wants to see the mechanics. He wants to see what you do and all this type of stuff. And if he can see that of the pitcher or the batter, man, he he's gonna sign him. He's, well, sign that's pro, that, that's pro though. But he's gonna cut a check and get your kid in there. And if you if you do reconsider baseball, yeah, it's the it's the sport that you can play into your phone. Yeah, that's not football like somebody hitting your ribs every day. Yeah, you might get hit by the ball a few times, but <laughs> both my kids did that just playing catch. Ding! <laughs> Bet you get that glove up next time, won't you? <laughs> yeah, and my daughter, she played uh, 12 inch softball. And I think both of them got hit in the head with the ball the same week. <laughs> I'm not sure if I got both of them on camera, but I was running from Kiri to Morgan Park. Kiri to Morgan Park. Kiri for softball, Morgan Park for baseball. Oh, man. It was just crazy. <laughs> there goes the runner. But, oh, oh. Got him in the rundown. The throw home. Tag that home, 40 out. The uh, trailer does get back. He is running up the back of the uh, lead runner and they uh, got into a situation. Oh, Balk is called on the pitcher um, and that will send the base runner to third. <laughs> Blue covered his butt. <laughs> I told him six times, what else can I do? Short lead at third, the pitch. Up high. Score the run. Ten two ball game.
but these are they are young guys too, freshmen and sophomores. You know, on on the yellow team, uh, a little bit older. Steals third. I can't double dip though. <laughs> One coach pays for a game, another coach pays for the other game. Yeah, so th that works out. That puts runners at the corners for the Cyclones. What we find out, coach, I got 10-2. Woo, swings through, and here comes the lead runner. He will score. Trailer will remain on first. Coach, coach, coach. Oh, he's trying. Oh, both um, both base runners return. What you got? Yeah, I know you don't know. Yeah. <laughs> 10, 11, something. Okay. <laughs> 11 is 11? Okay. Okay. Runners at the corners for the Cyclones and 11 2 score. And there goes the runners. Oh, there's the bunt, but foul. In there for a strike. Runners in scoring position. And here comes the coach. Oh, what, five years ago? Oh, behind the batter. Here comes the base runner. Scored a run. 12 2. Chicago Agricultural. We still have a runner on third base. Slaughter rule should be in full effect. Woo! Swings too. I can feel the breeze over here. <laughs> yeah, they had a little humor every now. <laughs> <laughs> to go to go to college, they need some money. <laughs> Inside, he here comes the um, oh, they're calling that foul, so he'll have to retreat. Runners at the corners. This this is a Simeon trick here. Oh no, come on. Score the run. And folks, that's game. <laughs> the first time I saw that years ago, the uh the, the runner on first was way back here in the grass. Just to upset the pitch. The pitcher was like and he's looking at the guy on third, looking at the guy on first. What's going on? <laughs> I didn't know what to do. It, I think it was Simeon and Brooks. It was at Brooks Field, so it was Brooks. Oh, wow. And he did that just to trick, you know, stir things right. up. And it worked. They won the game. <laughs> and, folks, there's your um, last game. Um, your final 13-2. Cyclones. And there it is. That's what I do. <laughs> and I get, I get a kick out. Sometimes I'm on the field, big games, championship, city, and interviewing people, getting a close up of the trophies and all this type of stuff. So it's I, I get a big kick out of it, man. Yeah, yeah. I wear some like Cubs gloves or something, something like that. You know, when I know I'm going to be on the field. But um, oh, 